Welcome back YouTube. Today we're gonna go, it's gonna be a quick one, but uh, so I had a tune professionally. It rips, it's scary. Uh, I might wanna rename this thing Shitbox of Death or something because it's not normal. Anyways, uh, so I had it professionally tuned, went through it, uh, sent them the base file from ChatGPT, which they didn't know about, and uh, Needs to say, they change it quite a bit. So, this is going to be a quick one. Let me just open up my laptop here and kind of go over what's going on here. Now, if you look at this base map right here, they loaded in this. Significantly different. Significantly. I mean, it's... It's smooth, it has nice acceleration. Um, put all the proper times in here. Uh, also, the ignition table. Uh, Chat GPT was closer on this one, but not quite. So this is uh, what I ended up with after paying for a service. Um, it got the minor stuff right, so, like, control limits, I mean, that really doesn't matter, right? You could pull 20% of fuel or add 20% of fuel. Um, it doesn't even really need that right now. Like, even from idle... Let me zoom in a little bit here. I'm sorry about my fat finger. Even from idle uh, up to, like, zero pounds of boost, I mean, this is just what it was set at. I mean, it pulls, like, 1% or adds, like, 3%. It's not crazy. Uh, let's see here. What else was added? Um... He changed uh, injector time on fuel enrichment, so that's expected, right? These are things just from years of experience from tuning this. The kid's, kid's good. So I'm really, really happy with the way this thing came out on the tuning. Um, but yeah, went through like everything and it works. I mean, it works maybe a little too well. But it's good. So. So would I recommend the ChatGPT tune? I don't know. Uh, it taught me more than uh, I knew before. It helped me set up the dual settings were pretty much close. Uh, basic settings that really didn't matter, like O2 correction. I mean, it, it it got it close, but it wasn't, it's it's got a long way to go. I mean, this is ChatGPT4 I use, so um, I'm not gonna play with it on five, so. It is what it is. I think this thing runs well. Really well. It's a little scary. It sounds like it's going to... Not the engine, but the actual truck itself. It's a tin can, so it's rattling and making all sorts of ungodly noises on a short drive. But it, it rips. I know that. So, really excited about this. Um, I'm gonna give it Give it a few weeks. See how it is. You know? Put some miles on this thing and uh, actually get to enjoy it. Did chat GPT get this thing right? 50% of it, 40% of it. Base settings, uh, definitely the map table needed a lot of cleaning up and the ignition table, right? The end of it.
the tuner was the best investment, right? So gives a little assurance knowing that, you know, they're familiar with this type of setup and, you know, what's expected of it. You could read the logs and interpret it like a human would interpret it, right? So it's not there yet. It's not there. But maybe, maybe one day you'll just be able to plug your laptop in, go to the website and or use the app or whatever they want to do and it'll just dial in and do it. But until then, I'll be hiring tuners. So anyways, very soon there'll be uh, some burnout videos or some wild shit. I'm going to try to blow this thing up. So enjoy your uh, Sunday, everyone.